no one was utilizing him right. Then Rockstar came along and reinvented how the character played, and that changed everything. For sure. So it really just takes, and like, or like Machamp and Wingtide. Like, Wingtide's like really reinventing a lot about how Machamp works, and people yeah. are viewing it in a different way. Every character's broken in this game. <laughs> you just gotta find out a way to make it broken. Cooper Blasters, but I slice my nut. Alright, is this Haru and Spud? Uh, yes. Gotcha. Alright, so Haru right off his win against E.T. Um, Spud, this is probably the first time I've seen his Gengar of the Night. He was doing a lot of practice before, but he's doing his Mario because he easy. Alright, <laughs> so doing a lot of defense right here. Ooh, okay, nice 2 light 3 yeah. okay. so, He's running Mew too, that's just such a nasty support. Because, like, Gengar's just damage output just really isn't as much as he would want for, um, like, the amount of effort he has to put in to do it. Especially against 660 HP characters, so Mew just bumps that up so much. Oh, for sure. I like that whiff punch there. With that JYAC. Whoa, Ooh, nice. how did that JX miss? <laughs> Ooh, okay, here comes the combo. Oh, what? Alright, alright. Nice, I do agree. Umbrella, I think, is a really solid pick for. Gengar. What do you usually what do you usually use against Spud? I I usually use a uh, buff basically buffing support. I like uh mm -hmm. you no know, I like Eevee. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to like Sylveon, but I like I kinda like really like Eevee because it's a it's a consistent buff that you get from it. Mm -hmm. you no, know, so you battle against Mega Gengar with it. Yeah, I get once you get back your uh, your lights and that lets you poke yeah, back. Definitely. Yeah. Alright, so, ooh, not quite respecting the JX right there. Getting the confirm off of the two. Sort of folks looking pretty close to that. Oh, wow. He, I think he, he called that out, too. Yeah, he avoided the debuff, and that's what really mattered. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's a big one. That's a big one. There you go. Go for the damage. Ooh, alright. So, against Gengar, do you, do you usually value, like, just big damage combos or resets? Depends on who I'm playing, really. Mm -hmm. I've always, like, seen that, like, as... Um, every interaction with Gengar is scary because he can just iframe through like a lot of the things he do. So I, right. I, I usually go for big damage right away on the right against the wall, where he has nowhere to run. For because sure. like I think like the more you risk against Gengar, the more you lose. I think if Gengar has so many options that beat so many other options, that right. you have to just take everything you get and maximize it. Definitely feel like Gengar is probably the best character in the game when it comes out getting out of the nice perfect oh, block. Oh, wow. That was, sick. that was so good. <laughs> but when it comes out to like getting out of disadvantage mm -hmm. state, he can I think flip Gengar it around. Really good. Like and just Sir Spud, in particular, just uh, him as a player, he's mm -hmm. also really good at you know identifying those opportunities to get out of disadvantage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, cause it really just takes one um, one disappear into JY. That's the only, like that's all it takes right. to get out of uh, disadvantage. And if they shield it, like at least you, like I think at least you like plus four. Right. So if he uh, against, especially against tall characters, so like it's just one JY is all he needs. If he can just get that somehow, he can get himself out of disadvantage. Ooh. Okay. So that's a. Oh. Oh. Okay. Did it. <laughs> Ooh, that was a risky bulk up. It was not quite enough advantage to get that off. And this is what I'm talking about. He's just against the wall. A hard knockdown, and he just got one JY and got himself out of it with a reset to boot. Oh, ooh, okay, this is this would be huge for Haru. Boom! All right, now he's just one submission away, one mix-up away from dying. Ooh, okay, this is this is a little bit dangerous. Right, got himself out of the corner, but literally just one grab, one submission, yeah. one cross chop right here. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Still avoid that attack to you, but nice job by Haru. Just make sure he keeps this going as long as possible. He's perfectly fine waiting this out. Like, he's like, we're falling that meter too against those shadow punches. Alright, falls for some of those shadow balls. Um, I see that's an interesting choice. Um, not sure. I'm not sure, like, if he's trying to avoid that attack debuff. Spud is playing super patient right now. He just, he realizes he's just one mix of weight. He doesn't have that rage defense to help him out. Now he just gave Haru rage. Probably literally and mechanically. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. There, using those iframes. Mm -hmm. And that was really smart play by Sir Spot. He's literally just like, I'm not going to commit to anything. Haru wasn't committing to anything. He had no reason to approach, so he didn't. Because mm -hmm. if he messed up once, when accidentally my state missed a mix up, he was dead. Right. So just real, really smart. Not committing to anything, not being impatient. 
That's one thing I think Surf Blood really, really excels at is just patience. For sure. Like, I could just, like, game against a wall, and he will just never stop shielding, ever. Like, he will never panic, and, like, just panic 8x or anything like that. He just won't do it. That's something I can really, really admire. Alright, that could fall there. Ooh, that's big, that's big. Flipping against the wall. So he tries to get himself in. Flipping against the wall again. Oh, no! Oh, too oh, early. That was... <laughs> oh, that's super unfortunate. Alright, and... There's the Mew Call as well. Get that attack back up. I don't know what Haru is going for here. He just cannot get in. Surf Blood just. Yeah, he's again, just waiting out this burst. Yeah, patience is really, really well on Surf Blood's key strengths. Now Haru can't really fight back against this burst, or he can't fight back well. Ooh, that's gonna be huge. Oh, that hurts. That hurts. That's gonna put him in the corner, too. Alright, now what is the option here for Surf Blood? Knowing that Haru is really scared right now. Well, what's the option? And okay, Haru doing a really, really nice job just walking, walking. That's what you want to do. And, go. but... And there's the reset. Mm -hmm. That's what Surf Spot wanted right there. Thank you for going for the grab and not making us sit through the animation. <laughs> <laughs> what a champ. <laughs> All right, and that is it. Surf Spot taking a solid two over Haru. But I think that was a really nice showcase of why Surf Spot is as good as he is. Just that mm -hmm. patience.